Today is August 6th, and I'm here at the Rapacan Martial Art in Vallejo. Today I'm signing a fighter. What's your name again? Jamario Motor. Jamario Motor. Um, he's taking a short notice, a uh, two week notice for the upcoming Dragon House 23 fight against JJ Okanovich from San Jose. Now, Jamayo, tell a little bit about yourself. Well, <clears throat> uh, I come under my boy, his name's Sergio, Sergio Salguero. He's a former professional fighter, former world champion, and I'm a champion myself, but I look to, you know, hope someday reach up to his level and even surpass him, supposedly, hopefully. But other than that, <clears throat> um, I train independently with him. Me and him, we specialize in stand up. That's kind of where we specialize at. But uh, you know, we can also go to the ground. I have a couple wrestling experience. You know, I can do anything. I'm a break dancer. I'm into free running, parkour, flips, and all kind of stuff, which should make me a perfect, you know, comp a competitor for this sport. So now, that's pretty much. Jamal, and I gotta address a little bit of all the MMA fans who doesn't know this young upcomers uh, fighter. So I saw him fighting on one of the amateur fights a couple years back against one of the guys from my gym. I was super impressed with the way how you performed because you jump up one way class in a really, really short notice and the fight went to distant and my guy just come up with a better person on that day and the winning by split decision but that fight can go either way and I was watching you how you strike and the way you wrestle, the way you move. It's a super athlete. And uh, that's one thing why I'm reaching out to you and this, you know, feeling this spot in two weeks short notice against a really tough opponent, a gamer from San Jose, JJ Okanovich. Now, tell us a little bit about what your thought on him and what's your game plan coming into this fight. Well, I've seen a couple of his fights. He's a pretty good wrestler. You're not going to have respect for him, of course, because I've seen his fights. He, he, can, he can take a hit. He can definitely take you down. He can definitely tap you out. And... I had a couple situations like that training in gym, but that's what we're working on right now, me and my boy Sergio. Okay. Other than that, you know, I have a lot of respect for him. I expect an exciting fight. Mm -hmm. So me and him should be pretty good. Like I said, I have a little wrestling experience, so maybe we can wrestle. I like to keep it standing up, but <clears throat> I have a lot of respect for the guy, but I'm here. I'm so this fight, I know you're taking a short notice fight. It's going to be a catch away 160 pounds coming into this fight and uh, and also it's you're making your pro debut this is like big thing well anybody who doesn't know when a when an amateur fighter after they put in a couple years of hard work when they're making a pro debut that's the biggest day biggest moment in their career so I know this is an exciting moment for you to coming into the fight so now um, on your training what do you have especially trained to prepare for him for this fight uh, we want to keep this standing that's what I want I'm, I've been working a lot on power, a lot of combos, a lot of slips, a lot of everything you need for a stand-up fight. So we're probably preparing a stand-up. I don't look to get tapped out. I've been working day in, day night, working on not getting tapped out. So I don't expect any tap outs at all in my career. But other than that, I expect standing. I expect, a, you know, a, a good bang out. Yeah. You know, so we want that. And I think the fans will like that as well. So. Yeah, yes, yes. Yeah, you yes. know, the fans love that about me. But other than that, you know, I expect to stand up. I expect... You know, one of us to get knocked out, I expect something to happen. Something. That's awesome. It looked like it's a, it's a big time gamer right here. Definitely August 20 is going to be a big time firework. Now, if people want to reach out to you, get tickets, come watching you fight, how do people can get a hold of you? <laughs> All right. I have Facebook. That's more of my personal way. You know, people want to know me personally. You know, if you guys are interested in knowing me personally, I use Facebook. It goes, uh, just look, search up Jamario Motor. You should be able to find me. It's pretty obvious. And I also have an Instagram. I just made that for all fighting purposes only. So if anyone want to reach me, want to reach me through Instagram, I apologize. Anyone who wants to reach me through Instagram, same thing. Just type in Jamario Motor. You should. My name should pop up. Other than that, like I said, Facebook is more of a personal. You know, know me personally. People, anybody who wants to know me personally, Instagram is more business related. So anything. That's awesome. Any sponsor you want to shout out to? <laughs> um. Not entirely sponsors, but I'm just, you know, people. That's, you know, mainly my go-to. I, I, I love the people. I want to give a big shout-out to my boy, Sergio Saguero, like I said, former pro, former world champion. I trained under him one-on-one -on -one time, a lot of one-on-one -on -one time with him. And, he, of course, all my friends, you know, I got a lot of support from friends, and I hope for us all, you know, it's Well, excel. Sergio, I know Sergio for a while. He's definitely one of the OG in the Bay Area. He's been around the block for a long time in this business. He's definitely coming out a good good camp you're having a good umbrella over your head and um, I can't wait to see what you guys are gonna bring on the bring on the table on August 20 
So now everyone want to find out more information about the layout fight card, check out DragonHouseMMA.com and please subscribe to our YouTube channel, Dragon House MMA on YouTube. We'll see you guys out there. And one last question. I know you're fighting 160 pound catch weight. What do you walk around weight? Uh, lately I've been walking around at 180. You 180. know, yeah, it shouldn't be a pretty, it shouldn't be a bad weight. Sure. Sounds good. Just... So looking for a firework. This will be the first fight on the main card for the Dragon House upcoming card, Dragon House 23, August 20. We'll see you guys out there at San Francisco Keysar Pavilion. Good to have you on board. Oh, thanks for having me. All right.